G'day Baron, today I'm going to talk about putting and really one of the biggest flaws in putting that you'll see is when people get their wrists involved upon impact and that can lead to the dreaded yips, dare I say it, okay? Um, so it's all about basically putting in terms of not using your, your wrists, right? And that limits the amount of, let's call it, activity with the club face through the ball. So of course you're going to have more consistent roll and more accurate putts. So how do we do that? How do we get the wrists out of the putting stroke? A really good tip or a drill that we used to do is address the ball as per normal, okay, and get ready to go. But just grip down on the club a little bit more than you used to. So most people grip sort of middle to, to up on it, but just grip down on it a fraction. So the end of the club is clearly above your uh, highest hand, so up here somewhere, okay? And then when you're ready to go, get a secondary ball and keep it in your pocket. And I want you to plug that ball in between the wrist and the club, okay? And what you're trying to do here when you stroke is hit the ball or putt the ball and keep the ball stuck to your wrist, okay? If by chance the ball falls, you've effectively used your wrists, okay? So we don't want to use the wrists through the hitting area. What we really want to do is keep it nice and structured, this little triangle nice and structured. So if we can put a ball in there, going back and forth and not letting it go, you effectively take out the lever system and it enables you to basically keep a structured arm system through the ball and yet again, take away movement from the club head, which is the number one flaw in putting. Okay, so the drill is, I'll grab this ball again, set up to your normal putt, get ready to go, have a secondary ball in your pocket, ready to roll, and just before you're ready to go, make sure that you've gripped down on the putter a bit so the end's coming out, grab your ball, pop him in the end there, and start hitting putts with that as a structure rather than that as a floppy area. And that will really help start the ball in line and give you a lot more consistency and add some swagger to your putting. Yips, 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 yips. It's only yips if you think it's yips. If you like that video and you want to see more, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And also the notification bell. But if you want to get all the inside stuff, head over to golfbarons.com and sign up for our inner safety. Yeah.